boats are going in the most remote places on Earth, in the area that, where nobody goes, where the scientists can't go. So the idea behind that was to, why can't the boat contribute to the data collection, to a better scientific understanding of what's happening out there? So GMR Helmholtz Center Ocean Research Kiel is a federal research institute for marine science. We are measuring a number of variables on a couple of the ships. That's temperature, salinity, chlorophyll, carbon dioxide, and we take samples from microplastic. I'm an oceanographic scientist and I um, analyze the microplastics data as well as the oceanographic data uh, for the race. I go to the stopovers, I collect the microplastics filters which the team collects and as well as the data we gather with the system and bring it back to Kiel to analyze the microplastics data further. When I come to the lab with the microplastics filter, we extract the content of it and then we, we measure these, uh, this content for microplastics with a laser system. So we count how many particles are inside there and then we measure um, the total volume per cubic meter as we can calculate for that. We have managed to collect groundbreaking data. We have identified microplastic in Antarctic waters. We are now understanding the scale of the issue. So we have a role to play to actually advance the knowledge of, of that um, microplastic and plastic contamination. We have created a partnership with UN Environment and thanks to the race, we've already created that advocacy platform. We already managed, thanks to the impact that we had, to have some countries sign the Clean Seas Pledge to further advance the issue of ocean plastic pollution. But I think that's the way we want to go further, really to create a, a movement so that we make things change for the better.